this video is about how to find the least common multiple. Basically, the least common multiple is the smallest number that each original number will divide into evenly. Let's take a look at an example. Say we wanted to find the LCM of 9 and 12. If you think about what the words in the term least common multiple actually mean, it might help you understand what we're going for. So check it out. In the mathematical sense, the word least, as you might have guessed, means smallest. The word common means shared. And the word multiple means number that it can go into evenly. So, like I said before, finding the LCM is just finding the smallest number that each of the numbers we began with will go into evenly. A good first step is to start by listing out the first few multiples of each number, like this. 9, 18, 27, 36, 45, 54, 63, 72, dot dot dot. These are just the first few multiples of 9, but notice that listing the multiples is the same as just counting by that number. Now for some multiples of 12. 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84. Alright, so now that we have these lists in front of us, the next step is going to be to simply compare the lists to see which numbers they have in common. It looks like both 36 and 72 can be found in both lists, which means they'd both be considered common or shared multiples. But which one is it? Well, keep in mind, we're looking for the least common multiple, so we're simply going to pick the smaller of the two, which in this case would be 36. Alright, just to recap, let me go over it real quick one more time. To find the LCM, all you have to do is list out the first few multiples of each number, compare the lists and identify which ones they have in common, and then pick the smallest one. And that's basically it. 